I'm Storm Tracker ET meteorologist Austin Haskins with your Tuesday weather forecast. We've had some gloomy and rainy weather the last couple of days, though the bulk of our rain the last few days was on Sunday. We are going to be mostly drier the next couple of days, though we still have a few small chances for some rain in the forecast before our next better chance of rain moves in by Thursday. So looking at the big picture, this low pressure just to our north is what brought the rain Sunday and into part of the day yesterday and even a few showers overnight into early this morning. That'll move away, though we still could have a few, you know, uh, showers kind of pop up this afternoon with the heating of the day. A low is going to develop to the north and west and slide across the Dakotas and Minnesota tomorrow into tomorrow evening and that will bring our small chance for a few showers and possibly a rumble of thunder for Wednesday evening. And then this low down to the south is going to swing up into the Great Lakes by Thursday and that will bring our next better chance for showers and yes, even a couple of thunderstorms with that. So let's take you through future cast and again, most of the day today is going to be pretty quiet other than some drizzle and sprinkles early Tuesday morning by mid to late morning in the afternoon will eventually clear out. But by the afternoon and early evening, there will be a few pop up showers around. Not going to rain everywhere and not going to be anything heavy, but a couple of us could see a little bit of rain around. So just be aware of that if you have any plans outdoors this afternoon. We'll be mostly clear to clear to kick off your Wednesday. Some clouds trickle in. Most of the day Wednesday is going to be quiet. And then we're going to see a couple showers, maybe a rumble of thunder, try to develop tomorrow evening. And then into Thursday, the clouds really start to thicken and we'll see chances for showers and a few storms increase into the afternoon and into the nighttime hours on Thursday. So here's another look at Futurecast because this one is going a little more aggressive with the rain chances today and also tomorrow. You'll see that right here. So the afternoon hour is pretty quiet. This one has the chance for a few pop up showers early later in the afternoon and into the early to mid evening hours as it passes through, but still the nature of it being isolated. And then tomorrow morning we start quiet and then most of the day tomorrow pretty quiet. And then the afternoon and evening we'll see chances for those uh, showers and possibly a couple isolated storms to pass through. This one is going a little more aggressive in terms of the coverage of rain. So I want to see some newer model data this morning and also tonight and tomorrow, and we may have to bump up rain chances. Uh, for Wednesday night, so be sure to stick with us for updates on that. So uh, over the next seven days and nights, just slight chances today. I, I don't have a sort of slight chance during the day tomorrow, but I do for Wednesday night, and then we're up into the chance level uh, for Thursday and Thursday night, and then just straight chances over the weekend. I think most of the weekend, though, we are going to end up being dry with a lot of sunshine. Now, we could have a couple of thunderstorms I mentioned tomorrow night. This is the Storm Prediction Center's outlook. And this area in blue, non-severe thunderstorms expected. So that would be from Red Wing to Shatek, north and west. And then everyone could see a couple isolated thunderstorms on your day Thursday. Again, no severe weather expected, but uh, definitely could have a couple rumbles of thunder tracking through the Chippewa Valley. High temperatures today, mid to upper 50s north and east. Otherwise, low spots should get to 60 today, lower 60s south and west. Temperatures tonight, mid to upper 30s, lower 40s. So a couple degrees cooler tomorrow morning, and a lot of that is because of those clear skies. Highs tomorrow, mid to upper 60s, approaching 70 in a few locations. And then with the clouds and that rain chance heading into Thursday, we will drop temperatures back into the mid to upper 50s. Still above average, though. Our average today is 53 degrees. 59 and windy on Friday. And then by the weekend and into early next week, we'll have temperatures in the upper 60s to low to possibly mid 70s.